What's going on guys? It's your boy DMT Sports back at it again with another video. Lightning dropped this one seven to two. We're gonna do something different. We're gonna make a car video today. Um so the lightning came out against the senators and they just came out flat off balance again um no urgency um after a loss against montreal which is crazy and um the senators wanted this game more um when you come out that flat um not executing on the power plays just letting the senators bully you it's just ridiculous um, the Lightning looks really good on paper uh, coming into this match against the Senators last night. They look really good on paper. Or the team's better. Just everything's better about the Tampa Bay Lightning. The Senators, they just look, um, uh, the Senators on paper, they look outmatched against the Lightning. The Lightning is a better team again. Uh, yeah, again. But I just feel like the Lightning didn't come out and they didn't come out and say, hey, like, we're the better team. We're still making the same mistakes, letting the other team score first. Instead of instead of having us execute first, they execute. Why are we, why are we in the middle of the season? No, no, why are we at the end of the season just always coming out flat? always letting the other team score always always trying to figure out the team and this uh, yeah but coming into the second period like what like why is this happening um john cooper said inside his um post uh post um post recap i don't care what it, what's it called post interview he said, yeah, basically the team came out flat and they wasn't executing. and they were turning the puck over and the Senators um, took advantage of that. But John Cooper can only say so much, which I understand his part. And as a coach, as as the leader of this team, as a French a franchise leader, you should you should put your players in the right position, which, which um, there's both parts. You should put your players in the right position and you should want to go into that locker room, motivate them, try to, try to just pick their heads up. Cause the lightning came out in the second, uh, second period. They came out in desperate mode, like, why can't we see that inside the first period? And I'm not trying to be negative at all, but it's just ridiculous how we couldn't see that lightning team in the first period set a tone. We gotta, we gotta see it in the second period. Okay, so that's um, that's somebody's fault. That's lack of execution on the players. Um, on the coach because I'm tired of hearing every post press conference oh yeah we, we came out short the other team is better this and that no we're better on paper we're better on paper and you telling me we came out short we did this we did. I'm tired of hearing that over and over and over and over Steven Stamkos um, I know he hasn't looked. I know he hasn't looked to. I know he hasn't looked pretty good these past couple games, but he said it was his fault. Which I don't believe that it's all his fault because it's the team's fault for not coming out there and executing and being the better team that they are on paper. I feel like it's the team's fault not coming together, not playing hard. Not not four checking, not winning their puck battles. Our face offs were pre our face offs was good last night, but you cannot let the senators. I mean, I'm not saying the senators are bad, because they are a feisty team that 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 is hard to beat. Even Boston, Boston struggles to beat them. 
the Boston Bruins, they're first in the division. They struggle to beat them. So it's not like the, the, the Senators are a bad team because they're pretty good. It, it, it doesn't seem like they're good on paper, but they're actually a, 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 a good young a good young winning team. They're going to be really good next year or the year after. But it just the lighting is looks better on paper. So go out there and play hard. Play your heart out. Play your heart out on the ice. Help your brother out that's right by you. Trust one another. But I feel like this, it's, um, it's not that they don't trust one another. Just we're not executing. I feel like Mikey Asimov, he had a good he had a good game last night. He, um, he was greedy for the puck. Why can't people play like him? Why can't a team play like Braden Point? Um, Kucherov, he played pretty good last night. He had one of them games where, again, nothing was going in. And I feel like the second the second um, period, we got goalied by their goalie. We really got goalie. Nothing was falling in. The goalie was making unbelievable saves. And that happens every time to Boston. No, uh, Boston. That happens every time to Tampa. Every time we, every time when Tampa plays these, these goalies that nobody knows, or these rookie goalies, we get goalied. Nothing goes in at all. And then the third period happens. No, the second period, the Senators didn't even know what to do. They couldn't get the puck. The Lightning were just taking the puck away from the Senators. So. Senators get outplayed, but why can't we play like that in the first period, in the second period, in the third period? I'm not saying we should always win, but there goes to a point where you guys are a winning franchise. And it looks better on paper. You guys were the two-time Stanley Cup champions. Hell, if we would have won last year, we we would have been the three-time Stanley Cup champions. But we should not be, we should not be losing against the Senators that are almost last in the division. It's ridiculous. We not, we shouldn't be losing against Montreal. Like, what are we doing? I'm not trying to sit here and bicker back and like, like bicker and complain. But sometimes you have to. Sometimes you have to let your emotions come out because you you care so much about this team you invest time into watching a game where where sometimes it's just like it's embarrassment but then again it's not because you care so much about the team well the team is not playing up to their standards and they're not playing like the winning Tampa Bay Lightning they are these past this past month yeah, I know the Tampa Bay Lightning last last year went to this. The year the year before they went through the same thing. So is this fixable? Yeah, most definitely. The Tampa Bay Lightning, all the players, John Cooper said, yeah, once we get in the uh, playoffs, it's totally different. Yes, Vassy's gonna have one of the yeah, Vassy's gonna have one of the shutdown games in um, the playoffs. Yes, he's going to play better. Yes, the Tampa Bay Lightning is going to play better. They are known to play better in the playoffs. Am I worried? Um, not really. Because I know the Tampa Bay Lightning is going through a funk right now. And everybody's freaking out, which they shouldn't. But the Tampa Bay Lightning knows how to win in the playoffs. So, we got a couple games coming up. The Boston Brewers, which should be a hell of a hell of a game. Also, the the Carolina Hurricanes, hell of a game. So then we got the um, Toronto Maple Leafs before the playoffs. So I'm excited for that. And then next week, I think we got the Senators. So I'm excited for that. So this should be a bounce back time for the Tampa Bay Lightning. Go out there and show Boston who we really are. Go out there and show Boston. Yeah, I know we're not the Stanley Cup 
defending champions. But go out there and show Boston that yes, the Lightning is no joke. We are no joke. We are nothing to be playing around with. We are the two time Stanley Cup champions. We are a franchise team. We built a dynasty. You might as well say it. So just go out there and even if it's a close game, three to two, I give the Lightning one in this game three to two against Boston or two to one. I give it that. But go out there and show Boston who we really are. Go out there and go out there and show the Hurricanes who we really are. I have faith in this team. Um, so I'm gonna end in my ranting. So I'm glad you guys um well if you guys enjoyed the video, um like and subscribe. I should have a video coming out tomorrow too. Um before the Boston Bruins game. Damn, but I don't know today was Friday. But I should have a video coming out tomorrow. A pre-game video. So if you guys like the video, like and subscribe and comment if you guys have any questions or comment if you feel a different way but i feel like don't match the paint of button yet the lightning been through this they're a good team and there's nothing to be worried about okay i know the lightning are playing like crap and they look like crap right now but don't panic don't match the paint of button yet just wait it out okay so again if you guys like the video like and subscribe and comment if you guys have any questions but um hit that like button all right all right always and forever even though we lost seven to two go bolts